Howdy y'all, round the wheel here. Last time we made pretty quick work of the black deck. And that means we are out of decks that are basically just one solid color. And now we're moving on into weirder decks with weirder textures and weirder stakes, starting with the magic deck. When you play the magic deck, you start with the crystal ball. That means we've got three consumable slots instead of two. And we start with two copies of the fool, which creates the last terror planet card that you used. So you use a planet card early on, you make two copies of it with a fool, you can start committing to a certain hand type pretty early on in your run. We're gonna go ahead and do it. And a couple of episodes ago, I, for whatever reason, was moved to say something kind of aspirational. I don't know why I did that, but it hit at least one person right. So I feel kind of moved to say something again, and it's inspired by something that happened to me the other day i was talking to an acquaintance of mine through social media in fact if you are very deep in the unk in the round the wheel lore if you are very deep in the round the wheel ecosystem uh you may be aware of this person i'm not going to name names but this is somebody that you might actually be aware of that i was talking to and I was talking to this person and they they seem to have very little hope for the election and they had just immediately descended into cynicism and doomerism and hmm, straights might be a way to go here i can only pick one i'm gonna go chip lead for now until i find a good hand to commit to but this person had descended pretty quickly into cynicism and being a doomer just kind of had resigned themselves to a position where they're like, well, fascism is all but inevitable. There, there's no use in doing anything. No matter who I vote for, it's either going to be a cop or, or the worst president we've ever had. Blah, blah, blah. And I just want to say I disagree with a lot of that. And based on his responses to me and to other people in that thread i think i think that person was operating from a fundamental position of unseriousness but but i just want to say that it is not stupid to have hope it's easy to feel like it is you know when you when you look around and you base things on your lived experience you're like, well, it's never gone well in the past before, so so why should it now? And it's easy to think that. But it's okay to be hopeful about things, I think. It's okay to be hopeful about things, even if things end up not going the way you hope they will. You're not stupid for having had that hope. And I hope you don't feel that way because, you know, you know, like, I, I don't mean to get all trite, but like he says in Shawshank Redemption, uh, hope is a good thing. Maybe the best of things. Not to get all trite and quote a movie on you, but, but you know, it's just, it's just something to, it's just something to consider. It's not, it's not stupid to have hope. It's not silly to be a hopeful person and to hope that people will do better today or tomorrow than they did today i don't think eh, i'll take it for the multiplier for now but i'm not playing shorthands uh i'm looking i think at this point for the straight if i can get it because we got shortcut there but yeah don't don't ever don't ever feel like you're foolish for being hopeful or for feeling that you know, maybe all of us will wake up one day, hopefully someday soon, and decide that we want the world to be better tomorrow than it was today. It's not silly to hope for that. So if that's you, then just keep on hoping. I've played a lot of flushes so far. We'll use it as a backup, but really what I'm going for is straights here. So yeah, enough of the, enough of the schmaltzy blah blah talk. Let's play some fucking cards. How about we don't or do? Yeah, okay. Even the 1.5 times multiplier helping out immensely there. 
All right, Seltzer retrigger stuff. I'm gonna be looking for face cards if I'm playing straights. I don't really care about re-rolls at the moment. Mm, I don't need to re-trigger hands right now. And I haven't leveled up anything yet, so good. I'm gonna see what this gives me. Can we, can we work on that straight run? Plus three molt for each joker. Yeah, molts, molts in the early game are good. And all my slots are taken up, so yeah. I was really just hoping for one good one. That was a mega buffoon pack. Eight bucks. Not sure I need the money just yet. Let's go, let's go for higher straight, maybe? Okay, just a legitimate straight, not even having to shortcut it. Very good. All right. Awesome. Fabulous. Yeah, this is without leveling up any sort of hand whatsoever. I'm really liking what we're getting here. Except for celestial packs. We're not getting we're not getting good celestial stuff. And I don't want to add cards to the deck. I'm so uncommitted right now. I'm just gonna wheel fortune it up. Look at that. More chips. Bigger chip stack. How about that? The Wheel of Fortune likes me today, so... Okay, decreases the level of our hand. We'll start with a... Discard. I was gonna say with a high two pair, but if we can just jump to getting the straight, I mean... Why the hell not? Let's go for it. Boom. Bingo bango. Pretty good chip and molt count pretty early on, but we're now that the arm is behind us, we're gonna need to start leveling up that hand soon. Okay, well, if we ever get a celestial pack, give me a ring on the telephone, why don't you? Next round, moving on to plus three hand size and a mega buffoon pack. Only one hand. Yeah, we're gonna need. I mean, we're doing pretty okay with one hand at the moment. Uh. Let's see, get rid of, uh, yeah, I'm deciding to go straight here. We're going streets ahead, folks, straights ahead. Yeah, we should be able to get over the needle pretty well, even with a low level straight. So as long as we get what we want, we should be fine. But that telescope was super mega handy. And now that we've done that, it's time for several repeat expeditions to Saturn. That's just gonna sweeten the pot against the needle. We're getting all the we're getting all the really shitty boss blinds out of the way early. I like it. I like it. I like what I'm seeing here. Uh, yeah. Let's let's start adding to the deck as well. We can get enhanced cards that way. Uh, sure, some money cards, and that'll uh, that'll also help pump Blue Joker. So there we go. Uh, I think I'm pretty cool with our run of Jokers. So here we go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Straight, fabulous. Photograph is going to help a whole lot with that molt on those face cards. So we want to play high straights. I'm loving what... Wow. And all of a sudden, all of a sudden, Celestial packs up... I thought a straight was my most played hand. What gives? What gives, game? Well, I guess if we gotta play flush as we can, but I thought I had hammered sufficiently on the straights to start. Whatever. That was weird. That was bizarre. Hey, an early runner. Well, anti four. I didn't realize we were that that deep into it already. Uh, but I like the polychrome molt. Yeah, I like the polychrome mold. I'm not, I'm not. This could eventually overtake Blue Joker very easily, but for the needle, I'm just going to sit on it. So we need a good high straight. We could get one right here. Uh, this is a low straight. I don't think I want to go with it though. So let's chuck it. Let's see if we can get better. Um... Five, six, seven, eight. Uh, still too low for my tastes. Uh, this could be a hand ruiner if this discard sucks, but oh, but thankfully it doesn't. Okay. Whew. Thank God for shortcut. There we go. We made it out. More than easily made it out, but it could have gone 
sideways pretty quickly. The needle can do that to you sometimes. Permanently gain plus one hand per round. That's not your tongue, that's my tongue. So, okay. Maybe this will tip us in favor of Saturn. Still nothing, what the? F There's no way I've played more flushes than straights at this point. Give me a Saturn, even if it's not... It's gonna be more profitable to play uh, wow, it's pretty dead even. It's a dead heat, flushes and straights. But I want to play straights. I've set this up to be a straight run. And with the mouth coming up, yeah, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be committing to the straight. I mean, if they're just gonna drop them in my lap like that, it's a lot easier with shortcut to drop a straight in my lap than it is a flush. So, what is going on in this cartoon? What the? I mean, I'd be stupid not to buy them. It's it's silly not to have such a valuable hand. But I'm really... This is really Russell and my jimmies. I gotta tell you. Like, like what is... Yeah, crystal ball voucher, copies of the pool. What? A, yeah. Okay, well. Keep on trucking, I guess. Look at that. Another solid straight right there. It is easily smarter to play the flush at this point, but I'm not getting flushes. I'm getting straights. Because that's what gets dumped in your lap when you have something as advantageous as Shortcut, one of my absolute favorite jokers. I'm going to open these. I'm going to open these, but I'm sure it's going to... Finally. God. Now the game is seeing things my way. About doggone time. Thank you very much. There we go. Now I don't feel as bad about playing a straight. Play only one hand type. Well, it's going to be the one that I get. Well, if you didn't throw a million pins and aces in my hand. What the hell was that? Uh, I think 7, 9, 10, queen, aces is straight. It sure is. And it's got a face card in it. Perfect. Yeah, these are, these are pretty hot hands. We might need something a little more scalable here soon. But for now, this is working for me. I don't think I need to increase my hand size really. I think I'm I think I'm doing pretty good with the base chip count that I'm getting from Oh yeah, I do need to be adding things with standard pack. Whoa, hey hi, how you doing? That's pretty beautiful. It's polychrome. Well, if I use it, it could break. But if I discard it, I get tarot. I don't know, I kinda want high aces or high straights, so I think an ace is going to contribute more to that. Let's go. The flint. Okay. The flint is not such a bad one. It might make it tough to get to a higher total, but... Uh, okay. Throw everything that's not contributing to a high straight right out the window. Defenestrate that crap. There's an SAT $5 word for you. How do you like that? Let's go on. What is the ooh retrigger our card in hand abilities? Well, if we start enhancing, how much enhanced stuff have we got? How much stuff do we want to be leaving in our hand? I don't know that the mime is really the move at the moment. We don't have a lot of stuff that we're wanting to leave in hand. Yeah, let's take some planets. Still wanting me to do flushes, I see. The game is really trying to upsell me on those flushes, but... And I don't have enough money for that, so... Let's just move on then. The game wants me to do flushes, but it keeps giving me the straights, so you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna take the straights. What can I say? There we go. Alright, 8, 9, 10, Queen, King. Right there, baby. You love to see it. Alright, moving on. This is ripping. We're ripping pretty quick through this one. Uh, when you get something like that, that's just sort of how it goes, I guess. Um, no. I mean, I am playing a lot of cards thanks to... Ooh, do I want money? Money or chips? Chips. Uh, yeah, I am getting a lot of... I am getting a lot of good stuff here. Suit does not matter in this particular build, so we're just gonna make some money off that. Why not? And move on. 
let's see how badly the let's see how badly this hurts our build let's get rid of all this low garbage and i think that's uh no that's still a bit too much of a gap uh but we want to keep the high stuff in at least okay we're gonna fish for face cards and we got the one we wanted or at least one of the ones we wanted there we go yeah that that does hurt a little bit oh gosh that hurts a lot of it actually um if we're not getting well we have five hands so wow even five hands after that oh yeah the nacho tongue i've really pumped up the hand size boy that is looks like that might be what turns out to help me out quite a bit here uh i'm not gonna get too greedy i'm going to just discard a few and see what happens okay so out the window with well nope i'm out of discards so nine queen ten eight, eight, nope nope too big a gap too big a gap so let's go ahead and get rid of some high cart we're gonna have to use we're gonna have to do it but even one more straight will pave the way there it is okay thank goodness Woo. yeah flint is a slightly scarier one than you might expect Heck, still still not satisfied Beatings will go down when morale improves. Is that how it's going to be, Mr. Flint? That's one of the worst ones we could have got. Because we're not looking at a super solid chip stack here. Uh, un unless we really get pumping along on this. Man, Shop really wants us to buy the mod. Whatever we add to the whatever we add to the deck via via Blue Joker is going to be super helpful. I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna do one reroll just to see if it gives me any heat. Oh my gosh, we're adding cards. Okay, yeah, that's the kind of multiplier we're looking for out here. We add just one more. We add just two cards to the deck. We're already meeting what this is giving us, and we're not using it for its actual effect. Get on out of here. Go on, get. Uh, free standard pack. Well, look at that. That's a good blind to skip because that's going to add cards to our deck. Uh, we can skip over tens, maybe, potentially. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Already making our investment back. And we want to skip the blind here so that none of our cards are debuffed. There we go. All right. So looking good going into this round, I would say. Uh, this isn't the greatest straight i would ask for but six eight ten queen king boy talk about your weird gaps but i'm gonna play that one i think we jumped over a gap almost every instance there okay we do not want to play full houses but actually i will play one just to get rid of all this crap without using a discard because points are points whatever gets us closer to our goal and it looks like we may be there with this. Hopefully this is a, this doesn't, yeah, well, yeah, it didn't benefit off photograph, but I was like, it still might get us there anyway. So I was still happy with it because we were so close. Let's make things cheaper. Excelente. Uh, make our straight stronger. Straight as an arrow, baby. Ram rod. Anything good in the pack? I want to see if there's anything good in the pack. Anything that re can replace 100 chips for a straight. Mmm, that's about dead even at this point. Anything good for Molt that would be superior to Abstract Joker? It's not looking like it, so... Oh, it was worth a shot, I guess. Um, but we do have a nice double tag. Oh, wow. Cerulean Bell. We could not have asked for a kinder for a kinder boss blind to anti-8 I don't think so let's see you have one dollar per unused discard for 30 bucks I think we might go for that just to have some money going into endless hey look at that a legitimate straight right off the bat now if I had card sharp I'd really be cooking with gas discard this 
I think we can get to face card from there. Oh, yeah, heck yeah, easily. This is exactly the kind of straight you want for this kind of thing. There you are. There you have it. Yeah, I think we're going to want some money to spend after Annie 8 just to see how far we can keep this going. Um, couple of bucks. I don't think there's any harm in looking at what a buffoon pack has to offer. Yeah, nothing terribly exciting there. No farm, no how. Skip that blind for... Oh, yeah, I forgot that was a double tech. Shoot. Woo! I'm in the money. I'm in the money. Da 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 da. There is not a straight here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just discard all this Garbo. Okay, that's looking a lot hotter. I, I like the look and the smell of that. So, give to daddy. Yes, please and thank you. All right. Ooh, six, seven, eight. Mmm. I think I'm going to go ahead and use this. I, I would love to leave it in hand more, but I already have the straight right there. Actually, I'm going to use this so I get a little extra money. So, still benefiting off photographs. So, there we go. There we go. That might have been our quickest win yet. The, the decks are being very kind to us lately. I very much appreciate it. Let's see how far we can take this run. We've got a lot of money in the bank to do something really nice. So, first of all, two levels for the straight going into anti-9. There it is. Okay. And do we want... No. 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 I, I mean, I don't really see a way to improve the build at this point other than adding cards to my deck six eight ten queen king there it is hachi machi okay yeah things are looking okay for now it's gonna be really hard to scale this without adding cards and i wish we had gotten hologram much earlier i've done some some i've done some I've done some degenerate things with hologram in the past, if I may say so myself. Yes, we're definitely going to take that. Uh, Saturn, yes, please. More rings on that finger. Looking like Tom Brady over here. Do I want gold seal or do I want lucky? I don't care about money right now, so we'll try hammering in on luck. Every card played, well, I'm already playing five cards anyway. Why not just get Taros to appear in the shop? That's cool with me. Uh, terrible. Mm, a little too late for Hanging Chad to tickle my pickle at this point. Retrigger all fate. Ooh, now there's... I don't know. Like, 120 chips isn't a lot, but... I mean, I've already won with this thing, so I don't feel like... I don't feel like getting too silly with it. Um, let's go ahead and we could go low straight here unless the game wants to give me pairs on top of pairs on top of pairs so I kind of want to keep this low end around in case the ace kind of leans me in the direction of a low straight which it's sort of doing but not really Seven, eight, nine, queen, J. Yeah, there we go. Well, that's... Well, I could have still played the six, I guess. But now I'm going to be having to play high card to get some of this garbage out of my hand. Uh, let's go ahead and just play this so that it scores and we get money. There we go. And maybe the one card we get will be helpful. Of course not. So, playing through the discard. Playing using those what are you doing i'm literally over here i'm just a boy on my hands and knees asking you to just give me the cards for the straight thank you was that so hard my lord hey we have a nice amount of money right now i mean it's about to go up but i noticed it at just the right time <laughs> because i'm a child so here we go yeah all we can really do at this point is do what little we can to pump Ooh, 
Hey, hi. Steel card would look good staying in my hand, but this looks good scoring. So, and we're not getting much farther, realistically. I think that's the third time they've tried to sell me the mime. Anything good, anything good. One more. Nah, all right, all right. That's, that's enough of that. If we get past this, then we'll really go all out in the store, but let's see, we're on anti-9 and it's debuffing clubs. Boy, talk about desperate. Okay, 8-9, Jack Queen. Uh, let's score this one first plane face card. I don't really care if the king is debuffed. I'm, I'm just happy to be getting the straight. There we go. Boom, boom. Multiplier. Hey, that got pretty close, actually. So I feel kind of good. Too bad that's a... Um... Huh. I'm going to go for the... I think I'm actually going to go for the low straight in this case, since I'm so close to making my... Mm... You got me changing my mind, game. Yep, got me changing it big. And there we go. We're just playing hands as discards again. Wow, not the 20 molt though. That was not too shabby. Okay, if you're just going to give me this Garbo, I'm not going to be terrible. Thank you. Someone doesn't want meets expectations on their job review, do they? All right, now it's really time to go ham in the store. Give it everything we got. Plus one card in the shop. We need options. Uh, temperance. We need money. So there we go. Uh, Hierophant. That's going to look good. I don't really want that buffoon pack, but it could give us something useful in the late game. I don't know what would be so great at this point that I feel super compelled to take it. Yeah, just kind of what I thought. Fat lot of nothing there. Um... That could be good if I get in a bind, but at this high level, if just for some reason I got to play four cards instead of five, but things are things are going a little too well at this point for me to be convinced by it. Uh, the sun. The man who is hanged. I don't want to destroy cards. Blue chip relies on that. Death is good. Death can turn something good in the deck into something else. Don't want tower because I'm playing for straight and a reroll is $10, so nothing else at that point. Ah, the plant. This is going to be where we hit up on trouble, I think. So if we even get to that point, uh, which I am weirdly kind of doubting. 7-9, Jack King Ace nothing okay let's go let's really pump up the jam here we'll make the lower ones lucky and we'll make the bigger ones give us chips there we go fabulous all right so we may struggle to get there but i think we will get there there's nothing in my hand that I felt like copying to death. I'd rather copy a steel card, uh, but I'm still getting the, I'm still getting the straights. They're giving to me every single hand, which is important. And I have a lot of hands thanks to Nacho Tong. So thanks to Donkey Kong. Finally, I'm using a discard. Here we go. Eight, nine, 10. Nope. That's too big a gap. Tend to King, the Tend to King pipeline is not where we would want it to be. So yeah, I think we can get through small blind. Uh, we got two hands left. We may even be able to get through big blind. If we get, you know, nothing but straights in our hand, we still have one hand left. It would take some fairly good pumping at this point Ooh, hey now that might be worthwhile that might well it would make low straights worth play. Ooh, hey okay how many uncommons i got one two i think we might have to make way for baseball card because having 1.5 times 1.5 times two wow okay 
Uh, looks like... I mean, I'm only losing 50 chips by getting rid of this, which is not, I think, going to really make or break the chip counts. So... Go for it. You, come here. Let's go. Mickey Mantle rookie card in play. Face up as a creature. Let's go. It is go time. Okay, so do we want to turn anything? Okay, we got the Fool. Another Saturn level up. That's going to be hot. That's hot pickings right there. Very good, very good. Um, Why not? Why not? We're late in the run. We're about to lose. It would just be gravy. Yeah, okay. Well, well, you know, so it goes. But I think we have something a little exciting going into the... Okay, here we go. Um, terrible, terrible. Absolutely garbage. This is offensive to me. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Let's see how this adds up. Okay, make sure I have them in the right order. Uh, Okay, yeah, that's that's definitely increasing our chances of getting to 840,000. We are, we still have a dog in this hunt. Um, yeah. Doot, doot. Noot, noot. Here we go. Yeah, I did a pingu there. What of it? We're really, we're really tapering off here in the back half. Nine, seven, that's a pair. That's not nothing. Uh, nine to queen, nine to queen, not a thing, not a thing. So, bop, 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 get rid. Thank you very much. Okay, we're gonna wanna play the ace. And we're gonna wanna put this one first. Two times two, well, eh, I don't think it really matters come to think of it all right yeah we're amply getting over anti-10 points at this point i mean we're not beating the anti-11 allegations for sure but whatever we can just add to this deck to make it we want high straights so i'm probably going to be playing that gold card and not making a ton of money what have you got buffoon pack never hurts to see and, it, and it's uncommon. So, I mean, it's not really giving us anything fabulous at this point. See how many rerolls we can get out of this thing. Moon, Tower, both not exciting for me. There we go. I need some exciting tarot cards here if they're going to be worth my rerolls. I'm not really doing anything with this death, so yeah, I think I want the Hierophant and the Magician. So we're going to be turning cards like crazy. Okay, face cards debuff, so we're actually going to have to make low straights, which it pains me, but... Well, there we go. There's a... There we go. And let's see if we can make it happen, Cap'n. Uh, let's go ahead and make those molts. Yeah, okay. And we'll make the uh we'll we'll save it for now. We'll save we'll save. Well, we got to get through this. So let's go ahead and uh bonus chip these guys. There we go. And then the next hand, ah shoot, I did a real stupid there. Oh well. Well, that does leave two cards that I can just use the magician on, so you know what? The more the merrier. Everybody, everybody gets, everybody gets an enhancement. You get enhancement. You get enhancement. Look under your seats, folks. There are enhancements under there for days. All right. So get out of my face. Hey, there we go. That's just about the best I could ask for in a debuff face card situation. And you did the lucky tw plus 20 molt. Wow. Is it my birthday? Who ordered the strippers? Let's see. Okay. All right take it we're taking this as far as we can take it let's go Hal Jordan willpower let's do this I don't have any discards left so some of my hands are just gonna be gar hopefully this is the only hand that's garbage uh, we gotta we gotta take it as far as we can take it that's pretty good 
for one that can't use face cards, but I think we might be at the end of the line, unfortunately. We will get a straight to finish out uh, very kindly, but... But yeah, not beating, not beating the plan. Not having face cards, that hurts. But you know what doesn't hurt? Winning a stake on the first run. So next time, we will move on to the next deck in the series. See y'all then.